Hey everyone, I just finished with my episode of Towards the Future on my Auto Macedo channel and uh, there was a comment that persisted that I kept thinking about afterwards and it's only like 15 minutes after I finished it but it uh, it just really upset me just really thinking about it. Um, it's the title of this video, if you couldn't tell. It's uh, I miss the old you. I miss the old you who could, who were helping people and um, you helped me and uh, I, I miss that and uh, it just really upset me because it's like uh, it makes me feel like I'm not helping anyone now that I'm not doing my best to educate people and to help people overcome their obstacles you know I've talked everything that I do is about helping people and making people more aware and educated about various things. I talk about a wide array of things. You know, I kept asking this person, what do you miss? What what am I not that I was in the past? And there's there's no answer from this person. They don't they don't reply to that. Um so it was just very upsetting to me to to hear that and to see that. Cause as I said, it just makes me feel like that I'm not helping people now. And that could certainly explain why, you know, the viewership has declined drastically and not many people are really interested in what I make anymore. Um, and it just, I don't know, it just doesn't make any sense. It's just like, why does someone like to see someone when they're struggling and having issues? And according to other people, like, you can't educate people on this topic if you're not healed yourself. And now that I am, now that I'm happy, now that I'm living life to the fullest and uh, loving who I am, now all of a sudden, fake and fraud and you can't talk about this anymore and you're not helping people anymore, you're not doing this and that anymore, you're just whatever else. It's very really upsetting. Because, you know, I pride myself being able to help people and to hear them say, you're not helping people, so, mm. I don't know. We also had some interesting comments on the uh, the video prior to that, um, people. Uh, these, I don't know if you call them like these like social justice warrior type of people, but they, they uh, do do that with these uh, comment and comment these crazy things and they come in like a horde of people it's like they post it somewhere on that and like oh we're all going to come over here and dislike the video and comment and like all of our all of our friends comments and disprove you wrong even though even though what 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 one person said that i had talked about in the in the video you, you would know what video i'm talking about <laughs> you know she she didn't deny every anything that i even said in the video so Again, I don't know where that came from. I have no idea, but uh, I'm not really going to pay any attention to that because that's just, it's mostly nonsense. It really is. Um, if you want to just drive people there and just put on a face and mask and pretend pretend like you're all happy and that it's not an issue, just, you know, just show how you really are. You know, stop, stop hiding. So, yeah. That's what I teach people to do, to take off the mask and to be the real you. Be who you truly are. I try to. I really try. And it's such a shame also because as much as I would love to continue this and expand and grow, it's just not, I'm not able to. I try so hard. I try. And here's the other thing, you know, I focus positive intentions. Positive intentions to allow myself to be able to overcome this and, and to work on this and to you know, get the uh, funds that I need in order to continue this, but it's just, it seems like the law of attraction says no. You're not going to get this. There's something else you have to learn, and I, I realize that now. I realize what I, else I have to learn, um, which is away from, from what I've been doing. So, I'm not ready to say goodbye to all that stuff yet, because it's just built up too much, you know. It's like building up this huge tower, and it's like, mm. Will it all come crumbling down, you know? It's, it's not about crum it crumbling down. It's just about abandoning the tower to go to something else that is uh, better at the moment in my life. So, 
that's what it's about. Because as I mentioned in a previous video here, it's not about that you did something wrong or that you did something bad or whatever. It's just about uh, learning and growing and things along those lines. So I understand that. You know, I'm not, I'm not um, saying, oh, I'm, I'm a failure or this and that. Because I know that I'm not. It's just, uh, it's just upsetting to hear that people say. I miss the old you, the old me who was struggling, the old me who didn't love myself. I don't understand it. Because when I think back to that, I'm just, it, it upsets me that, you know, uh, that, um, that I was dealing with those sorts of things and I overcame them and then I feel a sense of empowerment and now I feel powered and people are like, we don't like you to be empowered, we want you to suffer. That's, that's just what it seems like in my mind. I know that's not what, what they mean, but that is what it seems like. It's like, we miss the old you, suffering you. We don't like the new you who is happy and confident and can speak their mind. We don't like that you now. And that's what's upsetting. So that's all I wanted to say today. Okay, so you take care. Maybe I'll see you on Asphodel Gaming tonight at 10 p.m. I don't know when this video is going to even go up. It could be 10 p.m. by the time this video goes up. So yeah, hopefully I'll see you soon, okay? You take care. Asphodel Gaming on Twitch and on YouTube, okay? Asphodel Gaming. I got a cool new logo coming up, so check that out soon, okay? Right now it's a leaf. It's going to be something even more amazing very soon. You wait. Okay, bye-bye.